Hi guys, Mike of Mike Reviews at All and Fights with Friends. And what a great year for streaming we're about to have with ESPN Plus and the Zone next year for sports fans, for MMA fans. Uh, and if you're not into sports, Netflix and Hulu uh, and the choices they have have never been better. Uh, HBO Go, if you're into that, of course. Uh, the final season of Game of Thrones will be coming on soon. Uh, just uh, an incredible year for TV altogether coming up, it looks like. Uh, so for cord cutters, which I think is most of us under 50, uh, you're probably going to be streaming. Uh, you probably don't have cable, or if you do, you're getting it because it comes free or close to free with your internet. Uh, so these are the best streaming deals for this Black Friday 2018. I want to give a special thanks out to CNET.com. They're one of the best uh, electronic review sites online, and they are my go-to. Uh, so there's going to be a lot of options here depending on what you're looking at. If you're looking for just the absolute cheapest get you by. Uh, for you or for a gift, uh, this is going to be a Walmart exclusive, uh, but it's the Roku SE, $20. Products exclusive to, uh, to Walmart. Uh, like I said, if you're going on Black Friday anyways, might as well impulse purchase it. They're saying it's essentially a white version of the Roku Express, uh, which is good enough to do the job. And Roku is claiming it's even faster. Uh, just Black Friday for that price. Uh, go Google Chromecast will be 15 bucks off. This is the newest version of Google Chromecast, 2018 version, $25. Uh, unfortunately, the Google Chromecast does not have a remote. Uh, the Amazon Fire TV stick with the Alexa voice remote, uh, this will be $25. Uh, I have... The, the Roku and the Amazon Fire TV, I've used both. I have not used the Google Chromecast. I do not like the setup of the Amazon TV at all. Uh, it's I don't believe it's very user-friendly. Uh, and just like it says on CNET, it says, it's not quite as good as Roku in our book, but if you're a fan of Alexa or deep into Amazon's ecosystem anyways... Uh, this price is almost too good to pass up. Uh, it works. It works fine. Your picture and everything's going to be fine. I don't like the way that uh, you search to find things. Uh, the remote is very clunky. Uh, their ecosystem is just very clunky. It's full of ads. Uh, but to, to be fair, uh, I am doing a review on Roku after they just gave me a huge discount. They're going to give me a huge uh, discount after this review on my Roku Ultra. So all full disclosure in that, uh, I would have been buying the Roku anyways. Uh, this is what I've been using is the Roku streaming stick. I was using the original model 3500 uh, until this week and I lost the remote. And they don't even make the remote anymore. They don't support it. So I'm going to have to upgrade. And I'm going to tell you in a minute what I'm upgrading to. But for 30 bucks, uh, this is a pretty awesome system. Uh, the streaming stick uh, works great. This Now it's got a voice voice remote. It uh, can control your TV volume and power. Uh, $30. It, it's really all you need. Uh, if you're going with the 4K, you can get the Amazon Fire TV stick 4K for $35. Uh, that's about as cheap as you're going to get on a 4K uh, stick. The Gro Google Chromecast Ultra, uh, if you are a fan of Google, uh, CNET says, and from everything I've heard, I agree, it says it's not as good as streamers from Amazon or Roku, but the 4K capable Chromecast plays better uh, than either one uh, for YouTube, Google Home, and your phone. So I don't know exactly what the phone functions are. Maybe some of you guys do out there, though. So I hope that's helpful to somebody. Uh, this is what I will be getting on Black Friday. This is the Roku Ultra. Uh, this is the Coupe de Gras uh, for me. Uh, because this is, it's got everything. It's got the remote finder. Uh, it's got the voice control. Uh, it comes with great headphones. 
Uh, the remote finder is a must for me because these guys lose the remote all the time. That's why the last one doesn't work. Or maybe I lost it. Who knows? But uh, somebody lost it. Anyways, the remote finder uh, will come in great handy. I don't even have a 4K TV and I don't even really care right now to upgrade enough unless I'm going to get like a huge TV. I have a 55 inch uh 1080p so i i don't care that much uh but one of the big things about this is i have a good friend that has this roku and it has an sd card slot that you can hook and um a usb port that you can hook an external hard drive in uh now this friend has a four gigabyte external hard drive hooked in and then he has it um connected wirelessly to his computer so he can um, choose the movies that are on his computer from his Roku. Uh, great setup. Uh, anybody that wants to know more about it, um, ask down there in the comments and I'll try to get with him uh, for some more details for you. Uh, but that's that's the big reason. That's what I'm happy about. This one's normally 100 bucks. Uh, so it's also available on the Roku.com site. It's going to be available for $48. Uh, and they're going to give you some special things with it as well. Uh, as you can see, Walmart's going to throw in a $5 Voodoo credit and $35 Sling TV credit. Uh, Roku TV is going to do a $35 Sling TV credit uh, and a 30, day, 30 days of free showtime. I think there's actually a couple other things that you get with that too. Uh, and then they're giving me 30% off uh, on top of that. So if you do happen to have one of the old Roku's uh, that they don't make the remote for anymore and you can't find the remote and can't get it to work, uh, contact Roku, uh, complain to them, and they're likely to send you a promo code. I can't guarantee you, but they did for me. Um, I also did tell them I was going to make a video on them when I was upset that they weren't going to be able to replace my remote. But all is good now uh, because I get 30% off of $48, uh, which makes this incredible player incredibly cheap. Uh, Amazon Fire TV Cube, you're going to be stuck with, in, in my opinion, like I said, in my opinion, check this out for yourself, guys, because you guys might like the ecosystem of the Amazon Fire TV. I don't know. It's not a selling point to me. Um, my wife doesn't like it either. We got the Amazon Fire TV stick for free when, with DirecTV Now uh, so I could get all those great UFC events. Uh, but this cube combines a 4K streamer with an Echo Dot and a universal remote control. So that's pretty sweet. Uh, so you can ask Alexa, hey Alexa, you know, put on Game of Thrones Season 3, Episode 1, or, you know, things like that. So that's the best deals um, this year, it looks like, for streaming sticks. Like I said, starting all the way at $20. Uh, I think that's pretty amazing. Uh, my favorite, by far, of the streaming sticks that are out there is the Roku. Um, I know some people just hook your TV straight up to your television and that works great for some people uh my wife's not a big fan of that and this is much easier i really do enjoy the roku and once i get the great setup with roku ultra uh, and i get it is a lot less hassle i mean who wants to get down and mess with your mouse and your keyboard uh, and all those things every time you want to watch something uh so let me know what you guys think down there below, though. What's your experience? Uh, what are you guys excited for Black Friday? And what do you want to see me review? Uh, I have a laptop review coming up. Uh, look out for that one. It's going to be the best laptops coming out for this Black Friday. I'm also going to be doing some other ads for other things on here, probably mostly electronics, unless somebody requests anything else. Because... Uh, Honestly, in my mind, I don't think it's worth going out on Black Friday for anything other than electronics unless you're going to find a new car, a great deal on a new car, which sounds like a scam. Uh, but who knows? Uh, like I said, leave your comments down below. Uh, please hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new here. 
Uh, as always, I love you. I respect you. And I'll see you fine gals and guys later.